Let me accept you. Accept baby cakes. Shy, does your account name baby cakes? Oh my gosh. That is too freaking funny. That's fantastic. Thank you, James. That'd be great. Ban back. <laughs> the command ban should pull it up, though. I don't know why I didn't pull up for, for Kessler. Oh, maybe it was too quick. It was too quick after spiders. Ban all. Yeah, there you go. All right, I'm going for the same strategy. So the the, uh, the little Yeti might should take out the Inferno, no problem. Wow, way more, way more Yeti value. Holy crap, took out Bomb Tower too. Sneaky gosh, we will take out that Elixir Collector as well. Let's go. Oh my gosh, way more value there. Where's he gonna put Baby Drag? Same spot. So you two on the Dark Elixir, but Queen will get distracted by CC anyway and not have any trouble getting in. Scatter on those Super Bowl Breaker. Oh, okay, good. No, I still got it. I was about to say. Oof. Oof. Rip the dream. Okay. Put in the Super Wall Breaker. I think you have to put it over here. Otherwise, it's not going to work. You have to clear out this compartment, though. If you clear out this compartment, then it'll want to break open that wall. Wall Breakers do not want to open compartments that are empty anymore. There we go. Now we're cooking. Nah, there it is. That's, that was the key right there, Shy. This will be triple now. Because Queen will be able to go into this multi and take out maybe, is she, can she reach the CC from here? Because that was one of the main things that his miners got pulled to the core. Yep, she takes out CC. This is where the three star happens, guys, right here. So King comes in to, to funnel in the miners, making sure that they stay in front of the hogs. Miners come in with the warden. Hogs come in with RC. He should pop King ability here in just a second to get those. Yep, there we go. Get those barbs. Queen value is crazy now. Maybe even put in some uh, uh, some troops down there. Take a wizard tower. Make sure nothing has to wrap around. Queen ability pops. Make sure she survives the single target inferno. Warden ability comes in. Ooh, that's all. That town hall's taking a while to go down. Okay, good. Went down. Some hogs got hit by the bomb, but that's okay. Tornado Trap doesn't really bother the miners too much. Single Target Inferno is on the miners so that Queen survives. She takes out Archer Tower down on the 3 o'clock side. Check this out. Yeah, that, that Skeleton Trap is pretty OP on the Single Target Inferno, but I think he's got plenty left over to triple. Well done. Oh, time though. Time is a factor. Ooh, time. Oh, come on, Queen. Queen, come on. Come on. Come on. Now it's time. Let's do a kind of good time, guys. 15 seconds. These miners are slow. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. I think he's got it, though. Okay, good. Whew. I was about to say. I was getting nervous. RC should take this out in one shot. <gasps> Wait, what? Wait, what? All right, Warden Walk. Going in with the Super Witches and Super Archers. I'm excited for this. All right, King completing the funnel. Super Witch is getting tanked with Wall Wrecker. I mean, he spawned them first, though, so they're going to get targeted first. The big boys going in. Coco Loon making sure all the traps are clear. Warden using ability. Getting through Eagle. Queen is in there somewhere. I see her shooting stuff. All right. Single targeting Inferno going after the big boys. Raging the big boys. What's he what popped out here? Yetis? Yeah, he's to take out the hall. And big boys going after the hall. Yeah, he's take out a single. Yeah, Warden ability is already popped. Oh, this witch took the healer, took a couple healers, which is good, but needs a big boy to pop up. Ah. No, nope, she goes down. You do not want these super witches to die. They're a little tankier than normal witches, but ooh. The scatter shot is doing some work on the healers. Super archers needed to get some major shots off here. King is tanking hard for the scatter. When is RC gonna do her ability? Probably when she's on the multi. He's gonna have to use it soon because yeah, she was getting hit. Definitely did not want to use RC there. Come on, Warden. 
Help out RC. No, why are you turning around and <laughs> shooting the wall? Oh, rip warden. Oh, wow. Okay, come on, bats. Let's see what you can do. Thank you for the follow, Toxic Panda. You can absolutely do another base review. You just got to redeem the points. Come on, bats. Come on, bats. Come on, bats. You still got a free spell. I probably use the free spell to help out the bats a little bit. Oh, there's so much base to take care of. Come on, big boys. Really? Do you don't think there's a better use of your time over here? Which, really? Really? Wow. Wow, witch. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> oh my gosh. Good percentage, though. Good percentage, for sure. That was good. That was fun to watch, Shy. It's so cool. Let me try that again. <laughs> I think Shide is taking this personally, guys. Dude, this has still got potential. Exactly. It's still, I mean, the Yetis are strong. If the Witch can take down Eagle, oh! <laughs> like, what, one health? Hey, 98%. Wow. Wow, that was so close. Queen's still alive, right? She's somewhere in there. Yeah, okay, oh, she's shooting a wall now, so she'll die soon. <laughs> Uh, Super Witch is on a wall for some reason. I feel like that's a very easy walk around. Uh, has Champ been deployed yet? Oh, these witches going towards Scatter. That might actually... It could be terrible or awesome. I'm not entirely sure. Tornado Trap kind of stinks, but anyway. Uh, Champ, I don't think it's been deployed yet. Bat's coming in from the way, way west side. Come on, freeze. Freeze. Okay, good, good timing. This is a triple. Gotta be triple, right? RC's gonna come after the Scatter. Warden's gonna tank for her a little bit. Well, I guess the super archers will tank for her, but this should be triple. Free spell. Oh, this the the wizard tower got a shot off though. Come on, come on, come on. Take out the expo. Take out the expo. Take out the expo. Come on. Oh, they just barely got it. All right, but this this should be three. He's got enough super witches to clean up the backside here. He's got two more archers to help with clean up too. He's got a yeti still and three big boys and three super witches. This is a triple. This, this poor witch was shooting the queen like, healers help, healers help. <laughs> oh, no way. No, 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 no way you time fail. No way. No way you time fail. Come on. Come on. Get over to the queen. Can't distract everything, right? Come on. Imagine. Oh, but it was crushed, but it was crushed. Oh, shied, dude. I feel your pain. Just woke up, Shide. <laughs> James, <laughs> Shide woke up and chose 99% time fails. All right, Warden walk. So is it the Warden walk that's just taking too much time? Oh, he even uses the Super Archer to take down the air defense here. Is he going to put it in a tank for the Super Archer? I know she's got range, range for days, but I guess he's just using her as a funnel option. I feel like normal Archer could have done just fine with that. All right, wall wrecker going in. Okay, so Warren's going to follow them, which is the great thing. Super Witches and Super Archers all in. Uh, yeah, Warren ability. It might have been a tad early, but I guess he has to, he has to account for Scatter too. All right, big boys going in to smash the Scatter shot. RC in early too. He had her in delay before, but now he has her in right away. Super Witches going in towards the 9 o'clock side. Wall Wrecker did his job opening up the wall there so that the Yetis can tank for Queen. Really nice spread here. The central scatter shot, though, is going to be really interesting to see what damage it can do. All right, you guys are going to take down the hall, no problem. Super witches, wow, they got a ton of support here with the warden, too, and the healers. This side, uh, I might throw in the loons and wizards in here just to help out a little bit with cleanup. Maybe it's throwing the loon, uh, not the loons, but the uh, wizards here. I don't know. This, oh my gosh, that that's going to be a challenge. He's got three. He should, he should bat bomb that. Dude, drop the bats there. Freeze the Teslas and, and bat bomb it. That's the answer right there. Once he takes out maybe what else? What else is he going to take out? I don't even know why you would wait. I would just freeze. Yep, there it goes. There it is. Perfect. Bat bomb perfectly placed. CC poison it. Poison CC. Ooh, it may not matter because it's only single shots from the minions. I don't think they're splash. All right, freeze the multi. Freeze the multi. And this base is demolished. Yes. I mean, he, he throws it way late, but that's okay. Crushed. That's that's what we're looking for. That's what we're looking for right there. 
Dang, I mean, just so much left over. Cubic, if this base doesn't get attacked by bats, you can get a lot more. <laughs> this is why I don't base build. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's hilarious. All right, Super Minions CC. I'm getting sick and tired of seeing Super Minions in CC. I'm not going to lie. All right, so he didn't have to use Warden ability to save Wrecker there, I don't think. I mean, he used it, but I don't remember exactly when. Probably for the multi and for the, the CC. RC also went in early again. She's not picking up any healer support. She's got the popper ability here. All right, Yeti stick down the hall. King outside funnel there. Barb's trying to take through that storage there, but the single target in front of I think might take it down beforehand. Oh no, I'm actually watching that. Oh, that was nice. Uh, okay, Super Witches and Warden taking on Scattershot. Big boys coming in. Take out the cannon here and bomb tower in a moment. Bat bombing the, the central scatter, smart. Uh, probably should use a free spell though on the queen and wizard tower, because that's going to come in really fast. Ooh, would have liked to see the queen there get frozen. Uh, but, oh, we got a split. Oh, okay. Okay. So he froze the wizard tower, which is the max damage for the bats. Uh, single target inferno is not a huge threat. So if he could freeze right back here on this archer tower, no, no, he's gonna freeze the multi archer tower there. Smart. Yeah. Crushed totally and completely crushed all this. Once it comes in, they're quaking, they're shaking in their boots back here. This is, this is, uh, this is, this base is destroyed. Ooh, Tornado Trap Troll, though. I like that. Uh, Queen is like, I got this. Oh, no, no, I, I, I actually really don't got this. Super Archers. You know, Lady B's stream the other day had a lot of Super Archers. Um, with the Town Hall 11 Queso Cup. That was crazy. But should we get all three stars in Clan War? He would. He would. Off now, Ryan. Have a great 32 legends hits. Oh my gosh, crazy, dude, dude. What the heck? You, I swear you woke up this morning and chose 99% time fails. The big boy should take down the inferno. I think the witch even did she survive? No, she didn't survive. All right, let's see if time is a factor. Put in all the archers over here, dude. Clean up those gold mines. <laughs> Clean up those gold mines. Holy crap. Okay, he's got two super archers. Is he waiting to help clean up with the two archers over here? Oh my gosh. 30 seconds. As everybody has mentioned, they are slow. Super archers are so broken. I mean, you, you're going to find broken things at some point, right? Even if you nerf other stuff, people will find other options. Come on, time. Oh, time, time. Ah. <laughs> uh. When you're born into a fire